What you're about to hear is a phone interview with Gabby Chertok, CEO of Hydrospin. Hydrospin has been selected as the Autodesk Inventor of the Month for April 2012. Hydrospin was selected for their use of Autodesk Inventor 3D mechanical design software to develop a unique generator that produces microenergy from the flow of water inside distribution pipes. The energy generated can be used to support low energy devices throughout a water network, such as sensors, probes, and transmission devices. Tell us about your business and how your company combines sustainability efforts for both water and power. I'm the CEO of Hydrospin, and in Hydrospin what we do is uh, we work with both water and power. We generate electricity from the flow of water inside pipes, and we're using this uh, ancient concept for, for, for a very special purpose. Our idea is not, not to power uh, just general electricity from the flow of the water inside pipes, but using this energy, using microenergy for a very special purpose. What we do is we power smart water network devices, and in this process, what we do is enable the water utilities to get a smarter water network, get more data about their water network, save money in this process. And it's a fact that not many people know, but uh, the global average figure of NRW, non-revenue water, this is water that's being treated, pumped, taken care of, treated. 30% of all this water disappears in the flow of the pipe. It's the most expensive water, and it disappears it because of water leakage, because of water theft. And water utilities around the world are understanding they need to monitor their water more carefully and make their water network smarter. As this, in this part of this process, they're deploying millions of sensors on the water networks globally. The global market is supposed to quadruple by 2020. It's a huge, huge expansion. And when they're deploying these sensors, they need power for these sensors. Hydrospin fits into this world of powering the smart water network devices. And one of the biggest challenges that, have, that water utilities have today when they deploy these devices is how to power them. That's where we fit in. We fit in in generating the power, enabling the power for the devices, and also enabling and powering partnerships because when there's more energy, there's more sensors being able to be deployed and more data loggers being able to be deployed and more data and more knowledge for water utilities that are later translated by companies like IBM or Takadu, huge companies or very innovative companies that are working on taking this data, turning it into knowledge and helping companies save water. We fit into that ecosystem and we actually power partnerships in that ecosystem in order to improve the water quality and also save a lot of money and energy and resources for, for these water utilities. Gabby, how has Autodesk software helped you and your team with your project work? Well, I, I'm, I'm happy you asked that because there are two, two main aspects I'd say Autodesk has been helping us with, with uh, their software and our great clean tech program. Uh, since, since we develop products that uh, exist in the real world as opposed to software, we're, we have, a, especially in the water industry, a product that needs to be tested rigorously and need to be uh, tested under stress and under flow in, in very specific conditions to learn about the design and the features of the design and our specifications. And in the past, what we had to do is we had to go through processes that were uh, expensive and, and lengthy. It took a lot of time to design a product, manufacture it, and then test it and actually run thousands of cubic liters through the, through the pipes to test how good our device is working and what are the specifications and where do we need to put a focus on our, in our design. And thanks to Autodesk software, the simulation software, which as a small company without the Autodesk Clean Tech Partner Program, we would be able to purchase. Thanks to this program, we, we were gained access to very high quality and very uh, innovative software that allowed us to do con considerably important portion of the testing before we even manufactured the first part. And we were able to get some very good results that afterwards we had to correlate them and, and we're able to see that they correlated perfectly to what happens in real life, but we're able to get some good results and get some focus on what do we need to improve before we go to actual testing. And using uh, the various simulation software, if it's stress tests or flow analysis, we're able to gain valuable data, save a lot of money, and save a lot of time in our design process. Thanks, Gabby, so much for your time today. And where can our listeners go to learn more about your company? So I, I invite all, all the visitors to, and all the listeners to visit our website at www.hydrospin.net. And uh, uh, as I mentioned before, we, we power devices on the smart water network. We power anyone who needs telemetric equipment in the water network. So I encourage sensor manufacturers, uh, data logger, or other equipment manufacturers or integrators or even water utilities to come visit our website and see how they can uh, benefit the solution that we are able to, to manufacture with the help of uh, Autodesk. 
For everything about the Autodesk Inventor of the Month program, visit www.autodesk.com forward slash Inventor of the Month.